All right, assuming that uh, you've created your username and password for Linoit, go to linoit.com. So we'll go to linoit.com. And you're going to log in. So I've already got my username and password. Hit log in. And this will bring me to my where my canvases are. Okay. And so let's say you have a resources one or an iPad apps one. Okay. And so you can see this one from yesterday. Okay. What you can do is you as the creator of this click on the info button. And the info button will give you your URL. Okay. And so you can just, if you want, you can just take that and copy that and paste that link and send it in an email. You have to make sure, though, under preferences. So if you see back over here. there's a preference button here under preferences that access to canvas so this is do you want it to be public and so you want to make sure everyone may post stickies and then uh, you can have if you want to be notified when somebody puts something on there uh, you can put that there and then you have your other uh, details there that you if you want and then just click save so the one important one is to make sure that it's public. Everyone may post a sticky. And so now, if you want to do it by color, and so as you see on, on a desktop here, it's fairly easy. You just move them around uh, however you want. So we can move and organize. So it's a little bit easier. Now this one doesn't have anything. We just click on it, delete it. This one doesn't have anything. We just click on it, delete it. So now you can see it's a little more organized uh, and, and easier to do on, on a desktop. And you can see, you can highlight the new ones. You can see uh, what order they came in. And so, uh, like I said, the desktop is a little bit easier to get through and, and to create them. Um, it does work on the iPad, um, just a little bit easier on, on a desktop. So uh, if you want, uh, we can set it up, uh, or I can set it up, or if you want to set it up, I can send you a link. Just let me know, and uh, we'll go from there.